all right everybody welcome to your 23rd angular tutorial in which we're going to take a look at what path match is in angular and why would you probably need that well actually you wouldn't require path match all the time but uh, i guess in some case if you need that then you should know what that is or if you at least read it in somebody else code so path match is essentially just telling angular whether you want to continue with a route or not if the parent route matches right so what essentially angular is doing behind the scenes is that when you visit a url something like this angular decides okay so i'll just break this url into paths first of all i see this users right so we're gonna look for the users okay angular says yeah there we find we have the users all right now angular would look at the path match right so we have this property path match which is by default prefix now angular would look at this property if this is set and would consider this as prefix if it is not set now what prefix means is that angular is taking a look at the part of the url and says okay that thing matches but what about the else what about the rest of the url so with the prefix angular takes it one at a time if the path matches a little bit in the starting angular says okay i'm going to continue running this path and take a look if it matches if, or if it rather consumes the full url or not right so in our case it matches the user so it will just continue searching for children or any other particular match then we have this mayhole empt which in inside our children matches these two both of these right now angular has to decide again which one it has to go with again we have this id right now which is five so angular sees that this has got our perfect route and it has consumed all of the part of the route so we're going to go with this one all right so far so good but what happens if we make this full instead now if i save this and go to this page you can rather see that we get 404 not found now the reason for that is that uh, instead of matching it one at a time angular says if this route matches i'm gonna go with it otherwise i'm gonna leave it at all so it goes to users well it does match user but apparently it is not the full match right so this would pretty much just match localhost and then users right so it would just match localhost users with a path match of full but with the path match of prefix it will match the users and then it would check if it actually consumes the whole url or not but right now with path match of full it just stops if the url is not completely consumed so yeah that is how pretty much path match works in a nutshell and i don't think we really need to explicitly set it all the time maybe there are some use cases but i haven't come across them yet so yeah that's all for this one and if you liked it then please don't forget to subscribe and thank you for watching i'll see you then in the next one